I'm Guy DeLeonardo. I lead gas turbine products for gas power systems, GE Power. And you're holding a, uh, a nozzle from a gas turbine. Can you explain a little bit about that and, and what the significance of this part is? Sure. So one of the big announcements is our ability to achieve 64% combined cycle efficiency with the 9H802 gas turbine. One of the breakthroughs contributing to that is the combustion system. And so the challenge as we continue to push efficiency is temperatures continue to go up in the engine and that creates more of a challenge to meet emissions for the gas turbine. So this part I have here, it's a completely metal additive part. We've completely rethought how we first mix the air with the fuel before it burns. And that's really the, the first key to getting low emissions in a gas turbine. So how does that work? So I have fuel coming here from the right to the left, comes in through this passage, fills up this plenum, fills up this plenum around the tubes, and you may not be able to see it, but there's little holes drilled in each of these tubes. It's where the fuel picks up. Meanwhile, the air has come around. So I have air coming through each of these tubes. So the air, the fuel mix, come out here and we stabilize a very short flame. In fact, on this piece, you can see this has been run at full, full, full temperature, pressure, and flow conditions. And, and we've been able to develop and validate the part through real operation. That's uh, very interesting. Now, how many of the additive manufactured parts have you put into service? Sure. So I'm proud to say we've shipped over 9,000 parts already for heavy-duty gas turbines. We look forward very shortly to being able to ship our 10,000th part. And this part will be in full production early next year. Thank you so much for explaining the operation. Okay. Thank you, Aaron. My pleasure.